look smart. Okay, so it's Major League Soccer playoff time, and I know you don't care. Maybe one of you cares, but very few of you care. But as someone who's followed American soccer for a long, long time, I suffer from two pains at this time of year. Number one, my team's already out. Number two is that you're always going to run into someone who says, soccer, I don't know what soccer is. I follow football. Dear chap, I don't know what this soccer is. Oh, so soccer, soccer, soccer. What is, I follow football. That's the name of the sport. And they're not talking about the NFL. They're talking about soccer. It's just they spent a year abroad in England. So when I meet someone like that, it's important to remember that the term football in the 19th century meant a whole bunch of sports. A group of people got together and made a football association. When they did that, they were talking about soccer. So from then on, if you wanted to call it soccer, you called it association football. And then at Oxford in the 1880s, to be sort of cool and slang college kids, they started using the term soccer as short for association. I don't know how they got there either. One way or another, if someone comes to you and says, I don't know soccer, I use football, you just say, well, I'm using the Oxford term. Boom, governor.